Hit it. I give God praise, give him honor, give him glory, y'all. things over you, decree and declare things over you, 
prophesy in the glory of your life, declare it, and guess what? I'm looking forward to coming to pass. Amen. I said, shall come to pass. Amen. I said, baby, the Bible said, and it came to pass. You hear me up in here? Yeah, that's a I'm seeing things happening in my life right now that nobody but God could do it. Man, God is doing it all. Who here need to go to a higher financial level in your life? Say, please, in the name of Jesus. Who in here need to have more money than bills? Can I put my feet up too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two hands, two feet. Can I put my feet up? My hand up? Can I put my head up? Yeah. Put us up. Come on. She put her hands up. She ain't but one. She getting ready for the future. She getting ready for the future. Now, ready? Now, I want you. Oh, honey, I said I was going to do it. Turn to duty right in 28 right now. I'm going to do it first, baby. I told first lady I'm going to do it. Yeah. Got you. Okay. Yeah. You going? He's in bad shape. He's in bad shape. Everyone, we're going to take everyone in the glory today. Hand it right to me. Ooh. And the no, what is it, no debt? See. Okay, no debt. See. I got it. Go to Deuteronomy 28. I'm going to have y'all do something right now that's powerful. Yes. Yes. Stop right there. Her brother buried. And she is in the hospital. She called me this morning. She said she just got back. Honey, you hear that? Want you to pray for her. She's very ill. Her pressure is up. Her pressure, her blood pressure is up. Now, Evangelist Shirley went to Alabama to bury her brother, and she gets sick down in Alabama in the hospital for a week in Alabama. I don't want to say me on what he last Sunday. Went to the airport. Like three trying to get back to Maryland and collapsed three times. Miss um, miss she missed her flight three times. That's a devil. Fighting. Yeah. That's what this card is for. And that card is for her. We got a card for her. Amen. So comforting her doing the devil, her brother and her son was in the hospital sick in Alabama. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We stand on Psalm 107 and 20. And her sister and in the nursing home, one you and I went to. Because we prayed for her and the other lady in the nursing home. God, like these assignments where we go to the nursing home, to the hospital, lay hands on the sick. That they shall recover. In the name of Jesus, we release the glory to her right where she is. In the word of God. We plead the blood of Jesus all over the band of right now. My God. I go to Deuteronomy 28 for me, y'all. Look, I want everybody to watch. Because uh, what we're getting ready to do right now, uh, you're going to want to do it. And God gave it to me. I turned on an old film, and it was on there. And I did it for myself, but, but I've never done it here in the church house. I said, first lady, I'm going to do that tomorrow. I said, I'm going to do that for our church tomorrow. Y'all, I'm serious. Everybody better get it. Deuteronomy 28, if you don't have a Bible, raise your hand. And they will bring you a Bible. Raise your hand. Deuteronomy 28, y'all. All the way now. Need a Bible, raise your hand. Um, Trendy, uh, you really need to get on Deuteronomy 28. Because you always asking for money. <laughs> Calling from the University of Maryland. Dad, I need some food. Dad, I need a pair of tennis shoes. Yeah, I need this, and I need that. Uh, you really need to get in on this, <laughs> sir. <laughs> Deuteronomy 28. Daddy. Daddy, I need some five guys. 
Five Guys got the most expensive burgers in America. I ain't trying to eat Five Guys. Don't make no sense. And you love them too. I know they love my kids. They love Five Guys. I don't want Five Guys. Are they good? I know. They said. They said they got the best milkshakes and everything in Five Guys. They got milkshakes. I don't. Yeah. Huh? Oh, what did he say? Oh, the burger got small. Usury. Every, usury. Every business out here, let me say this to all the businesses. All the businesses in America, most of them are now practicing what's in the Bible called usury. What they've done is, everything that they had that was large, that was big, what they've done is they made everything smaller, charged either more money or the same money for less product now. That's called usury, America. Then when they go out of business, they wonder why after 50 years in business, why now they're bankrupt. Yes. First of all, you're not tithing on your business and you're practicing usury. I know. We're talking about the ink. Uh, oh, look. First, look. First, lady and I would get these ink things, put in our ink pen. Now they're filling them up halfway. Everything. Look at your potato chip bag. Usury. Usury. Got smaller than yes. usury. Y'all hear me? Cereal boxes are smaller and for more money. Jesus said you're practicing usury, America. Uh huh. Huh? They put in a whole lot of filler in the crab cake. A whole lot of filler in the crab meat. Miss Long was from potato chips to crab meat. We went to the real deal. Tell them what I said about crab meat. Say it, Miss Claire. When we were younger, candy bars were huge. Candy bars were huge. They shrunk. 95% of American businesses decided to go small on the product. Give us less. Yeah, thinking they helping their business, but they're hurting themselves. Tell them about what I said. They're hurting themselves. Tell them when I said it on the crab meat. You eat the crab meat, they got to put it in their mouth. All yeah. that, you don't know if they sneeze. Oh, oh. That's another story. Uh, 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 first day. Uh, uh, I'm gonna bring it up though. Go ahead. Yeah. Oh man, don't even mention that. It got more air in the bag than chips. Got it big up. The bag is big, got that much chip in it. Get out of here, usury. Hey y'all, this thing is real. But I'm gonna tell y'all this. First lady just made me remember. I don't care if it's a chip or it's a candy bar. Don't you put nothing in your mouth or drink a bottle of water, a soda, or juice without saying our blessing in Jesus' name. You don't have, y'all, they pass the stuff out here now that don't make no sense. And the only way you're going to be safe is to have it covered in Jesus' name. Y'all hear me? I mean, I mean y'all y'all got to do this. This is real. Whatever you eat, whatever you drink. Real quick, a blessing in Jesus' name. All right, y'all got me? Shut up. Yeah, what it is, I'm gonna bless it. In Jesus' name. You gotta be covered now. Alright, church. Alright. Um, yeah. Yeah, about the usury. I don't She's been praying that over her job to, to, to take over that spirit of usury as her job. Now that usury spirit is in a lot of places. Y'all never heard of that word US. U A R Y, usury. It's in the Bible. They practice usury. That's why he, Jesus had to go in and kick the tables over. He had to go in and kick the tables over because they were practicing usury. That means that the scales are off. When you practicing usury, the scales are off. You got unbalanced scales. You got you got scales that are unfair. See the scales are like this. Instead of scales like this, scales are like that. Okay, that's usually. Alright? A lot of people hiring people using usually. 
not paying them what they're they supposed to be paying them. That's right. usually yes. working like yeah, working like two slaves. <laughs> All right, y'all. Y'all know. Y'all, how I can might never hear this in my good, nice church when I was in there for thirty-two years. I can might hear nothing about real life. I heard good Bible stories, but I didn't know about real life. Maybe that's why I stayed in sin so long. But it never told me about my real life. You hear me? The church got to deal with real life. These Bible stories got to go to real life. So, God, my God. Now, are y'all in a duty run to 28? Help me, Lord. Now, here's what I want. Oh, know what I thought he said? Help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. It doesn't sound like in my ears. Seriously. I'm like, what? Uh, now, now, y'all, y'all, here's what y'all gonna do. Now follow my instructions. Now it's very easy. Here's what we're gonna do. Say we're gonna make it personal. I did say Bible Monday, didn't I? Are we ready for Bible blessings? Okay. You're going to open your mouth. But you only gonna say one thing and one thing only. Your first name. Hear me now. Y'all gonna say your first name. What's your first name? 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 That's all y'all gonna use your first name. Amen. What's your first name? What's your first name? What's your first name? What's my first name? Angelo. My first name is not Pastor. My first name is Angelo. So I'm gonna call my name out too. You hear me? I want the same blessing. Ready? Now, in this word, when when Hold on, man. I might have a signal, y'all, when they say your name. So look, uh, let's do this. Yeah. I'm going to point up to God and you say your name. Amen. Okay? I, 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 no more. Ready? Yeah. 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 Okay. Let's go. Start with number one. Deuteronomy 28 and 1. Okay? And it shall come to pass. Hold on for a minute. I just thought about something. Y'all can't see me point and look at the word too. So here's what I'm going to do. How about I call my name? And right after my name, y'all see y'all name. Okay. Yeah, y'all saw y'all looking down like they don't see this thing all going on. Okay, y'all ready? I'm going to say Angelo, and then y'all will see y'all name right then and there. Okay. All right, ready? Okay. Here we go. And it shall come to pass. If Angelo, yeah. oh, hold on, oh, oh, I felt that. Hold on, oh, oh, this is working. This is gonna work. I, I'm serious, y'all. I got chills. Y'all said y'all name. Hold on, hold on, y'all. I'm serious. I got a blast on the whole door. Y'all just say your name for the first time. I got a blast. I'm serious. God sent this for y'all to us today. Hold on. I got a blast on the whole door just then. Okay, y'all ready? Okay. Uh, let's start over. All right. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, that was practice. <laughs> yeah. Okay, y'all ready? Yeah. Ooh, hold on, y'all. Okay. Lord, strengthen me. <laughs> well, I just got a blast, y'all. I got chills when all three of my y'all said that. And it shall come to pass if Angelo Praise shall hearken diligently unto the voice of the Lord, Angelo's God. To observe and to do all his commandments, which I command thee, which I command Angelo this day, that the Lord thy God will set Angelo on high above all nations of the earth. And all these And all these blessings 
worship come on Angelo and overtake Angelo if Angelo shall hearken unto the voice of the Lord Angelo's God bless and shout Angelo be in the city and bless shout Angelo Louder, be in the field. Say your name loud, y'all. Don't be afraid to say it loud. Blessed shall be the fruit of Angelo's body. And the fruit of Angelo's ground. And the fruit of Angelo's cattle. The increase of Angelo's kind. And the flocks of Angelo's sheep. Blessed shall be Angelo's basket and Angelo's store. Blessed shall Angelo be when Angelo comes in. Blessed shall Angelo be when Angelo goes out. See all that for a minute. Soak in it for a second. Because there's some more coming on that one. Let's take it in. Oh, you've already called your name out already in the Bible, in God's word. Come on now. Come on. We'll just take it in. Because it's real. We're in the glory right now. God's word in the glory right now. Okay, ready? Verse number seven is where we are right now. So the Lord should cause Angelo's enemies. Mm. Charlie, say your name. <laughs> they rise up against Angelo to be smitten before Angelo's face. Lord, have mercy. Y'all know what they just said, didn't it? Every enemy is going to be smitten before your face. He you say some of them, did No. So all? Oh. Everything, every sign from hell yeah. will be smitten. Every demon, every curse, every witchcraft, every voodoo curse will be smitten. You hear me, y'all? Yeah. It's in the word, right? Yeah. Oh, oh. Come on now. Thank you, Lord They shall come out against Angelo one way. <laughs> and flee before Angelo seven ways. Say your name out loud now. The Lord shall command the blessing upon Angelo in Angelo's storehouses and in all that Angelo says, Angelo's hand unto. And he shall bless Angelo in the land which the Lord thy God giveth Angelo. God. God will give you a house. God will give you a new car. Amen. Receive, receive. I receive. Amen. Is it calling me about that new car? That new house? Receive, receive. Right there. A, a new apartment, yeah. new church, yeah. 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 a new business. Yeah. 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 Come on now. Yeah. It's right here, isn't it? Yeah. God said this today. He said this on the first day of the month. Oh, yeah. First day. Yeah. This is awesome. Yeah. Oh, y'all, I'm trying to keep myself together here, but this word is just blowing my mind, it's blowing me away. We put, look, we're making it personal. Yeah. God's word. Come on now. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Verse number nine. The Lord shall establish Angelo. And holy people unto himself. As he has sworn unto Angelo. 
If Angelo shall keep the commandments of the Lord, Angelo's God, and walk in his ways, and all people of the earth shall see that Angelo are called by the name of the Lord, and they shall be afraid of Angelo. living in fear. He said they're going to be a, what, afraid of you? Yeah. Coronavirus is afraid of us. Yeah. I mean, where the virus is going to be destroyed. Glory! Glory! My God, my God, my God, they shall be afraid of it. Take that me. We need diseases to be afraid of us. Uh oh, uh oh, hold on. You told me to tell you something. Oh, you did say your name there, right? Yeah. You told me to tell you that carjackers and home invaders gonna be afraid of you. Yeah. Rapists gonna be afraid of you. Yeah. Fathers and thieves gonna be afraid of you. Scammers and crooks gonna be afraid of you. And the evangelist just texted me and said she got scammed a couple of weeks ago. Scammers gonna be afraid of you. Liars gonna be afraid of you. Uh oh, I gotta say it, I gotta say it, y'all ready? Witches. And what? And demons shall be afraid of you. Really? Come on, God. He's working this thing. Oh, he's working this thing, y'all. Uh oh, hold on. Uh uh, got it. He said, Say it. I'm going to say it. Ready? Uh oh. Some of y'all might jump up and run outside after I say this. Poverty is going to be afraid of you. Afraid of you. Yeah. Just enough to get back and be afraid of you. Yeah. Death will be afraid of you. Yeah. I receive it. I receive it too. Yeah. It's powerful. Yeah. It didn't cut off, did it, Angela? No, I was just fixing it. Okay, good. Because the devil don't like this. So we're making it personal. Yeah. God's word, right? Yeah. Say Bible money. Bible money. Ooh, in the glory. Hold up now. Here we go. Ooh, hold on. Uh 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 uh. Verse number 11. Ready? And the Lord shall make Angelo plenteous in goods. And the fruit of Angelo's body. And in the fruit of Angelo's cattle, and in the fruit of Angelo's ground, in the land which the Lord swear unto Angelo's father to give Angelo. 
Some of y'all get ready to become property owners. I didn't say rent, I said own. Land owners, building owners. In his word is yea and amen. I wish my church had done this for me 30 years ago. Mm. My money wouldn't have been jacked on my full-time jobs. <laughs> Hold on now. <laughs> Woo, you're right, baby. Hold on now. Hold on. Hold on. Uh-uh. 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 Uh -uh. Number 12. Deuteronomy 20, 12. Y'all ready? The Lord shall open unto Angelo. Uh-uh. His good treasure. What? His good treasure. Hold on. The Lord shall uh, hold on. The Lord shall open unto Sandra. And hold up. Say your name now. Hold up now. I'm gonna point to you now. Hold on. Because this means everything. The Lord shall open unto Excuse me. The Lord shall open unto his good treasure. Sandra, Angel, Ernestine, Christine, and Eric. Say your name to me. The Lord shall open unto Come on. Trade. His good trade. And the Lord shall open unto Rosa. The Lord shall open unto His good treasure. Angelo. He's only up right now while I sit here. While right you're in the house of God. You hear me tell you? I don't care what you've been through. I don't care what's happened to you. I don't care where you come from. I don't care what they said, she said, he said. The Lord is now opening up his good treasure unto you. Thank you. And the Lord opens up his good treasure. Ain't nothing to tell Say, you can't do nothing about it. Lord, open up his good treasure unto. Say your name, Zion. Lord, open up his good treasure unto. Say Zion. Oh, Zion. Say Zion. I know you're one years old. You said it. I got everybody. All the children. All the children. Praise and, and uh, praise on the run. For dad and mama. Oh, right now. Praise them. So for praise and favor. favor. Yeah, praise and favor. How about this? Uh uh. God said he's not going to limit it that one. Are y'all ready? He's not going to limit it that. We got it personally, didn't we? Yeah. Okay, y'all ready? Yeah. All I was going to say is he, that one right there, he said, he said he can't limit that one. That was huge. Ready? Here's what I want y'all to say. Y'all ready? Yes. I want y'all to say, my family. my family. When I say my family, then y'all say it. I'm still there, 28, 12. Y'all ready? Yes. Because he wants your family to get blessed. Yes. How many here need their children to get a blessing? Yes. How many need their grandchildren to get a blessing? Yes. How many need their children's children to get a blessing? Yes. How, I was just going to say, how many need your siblings to get a blessing? Yes. How about mom and daddy? Yes. Uncle and aunt? Nieces and nephews. Yes. Cousins. Yes. Y'all ready? The Lord shall open unto my family. Say it out. His good treasure. Here we go. All right. The heaven to give the rain unto Angelo's name. In Angelo's season. And to bless all the work of Angelo's hands. Angelo's hands. 
Oh, take your hand. Yeah. Uh -uh. No, you know we're taking hands. Put it in the glory right now. The glory yeah. Yeah. Put your hands up in the glory realm right now. Yeah. 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 Oh, there's a glory cloud here right now. Put your hands up in the glory realm. Yeah. Yeah. As you got your hands up in the glory, look at all these hands in here. Supernatural gifting, supernatural blessings coming to your hands in the glory realm. In the glory realm, he's holding up the treasures of heaven. He's sitting on his glorious throne with his glorified gift, blessing his glorified children. Give him glory! Some of y'all right now because y'all done borrowed some money, ain't paid them back yet. <laughs> they wonder where that $50 at. Where that 25 <laughs> Some people hold a grudge from 1999. Now you ain't never paid them that money about that you borrowed. I talked to many people like that. They ain't paid me back yet. Guess what? God told me to tell you this right now. From this day on, you'll never have to borrow. 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 Have to borrow. Can you give me some money for the gas? You'll never have to borrow. Can you give me some money to pay day? You'll never have to borrow. God told me to tell you that the more you're going to get from now on, is the more you're going to give. Some of y'all get ready to get so much. You're going to have more to give than you ever had in your life. You hear me? More than you ever had in your life. Some folks don't even want to answer the phone for some people because they know they're calling to get, ask for money. Sure. You got certain relatives that if they're calling or if they're knocking on your door, you know what they want. Oh, uh, excuse me for a minute. Let me tell you what I did to my parents. I needed money. And I needed, uh, at the time, $1,500. Never forget the figures. I needed $1,500. I ain't got no money. And if I don't have that money, then I'm going to lose I'm gonna lose my house at the time. I'm living in D.C. I need $1,500. And it was at that point. This is it, sir. So guess what I did? I said, I'm not gonna call my mom and daddy in North Carolina. I'm not gonna call. Them. I said, I, I said, I know what, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get in my car. <laughs> I'm gonna get in my car. I ain't telling nobody I'm coming to North Carolina. I'm not asking on the phone, but this is big, one thousand five hundred dollars. So I said, I'm driving all the way down to that house. The ass in person for that money. So I got in my car that morning, y'all, and I hit 95 South. I'll never forget. Y'all, I pulled up in the driveway. That's what, y'all. I knocked on my mom and daddy's door. I'm like, Bro, what you doing here? Oh, my daddy figured it out real quick, though. 
What you doing here? Oh, uh, nothing. Oh, uh, oh. Uh, we didn't know you were coming. Yeah. Uh huh. And then I heard my daddy say across the room, he came for some money. Yeah, he needs something. He can't even get some money. My daddy knew my daddy, pick that thing up quick. And I'm standing there. And I'm telling you what my parents did for me. They went on and wrote that check. I knew it was going to take a drastic move. Personal appearance. Personal appearance. <laughs> I didn't want to do it, but I had to do it. I had to make a personal appearance get that money. Some of y'all had to make personal appearance to get that money. So, so, so I knew I couldn't get it on the phone. I knew by the phone they turned me down. Hey, a face to face ain't come to me. Face to face. So y'all, my mom and dad wrote that check and had me out of their house headed back to D.C. in 15 minutes. One more hang around, one more stand around here. One no, oh, I came to visit, uh-uh. Gave me the check and I was out the door in the car. Headed back. Guess what? You would not be the barber. You would be the member. Y'all hear me? Okay, we're almost finished. I receive. I receive. Come on now. Verse 13. And the Lord shall make Angelo. Uh -oh. oh, you better say your you better say your name real loud on this. And the Lord shall make Angelo the head and not the tail. Oh, y'all ready? You better say your name loud. And Angelo shall be above only, and thou shalt not be beneath. If that Angelo. Which I command Angelo, which I command Angelo, which I command Angelo, which I command Angelo. Bring This day. Say this day. This day. To observe and to do this. Give God praise. 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 Anybody receive this today? I did. Twins, y'all got this? Early, you get this? Mama and daughter, Papa, y'all get this? Sister yes. Ella, you get this? Yes. Sound emotion. 
culture. Sound feeling. Sound heart. Oh, by the way, another woman last night, she said last Friday. I'm sorry, she said on Friday night. She said last Friday, my husband had a heart attack. Friday morning. In the hospital. Had a heart attack last Friday morning. So have a sound heart. Say uh, sound glands. Sound glands. Sound body parts. Sound body parts. Sound joints. Sound joints. Sound blood. Sound blood. Sound marrow. Sound marrow. And say I bleed with no problem. I bleed with no problem. Say no headaches. No headaches. Oh, by the way, that same prophet that was in here. Who prophesied the uh, death free? Diamond, here it is. She had a headache every morning she woke up for three weeks. A headache for three? I don't want a headache for three seconds. No. I hate headache. A headache every day for three weeks. She came up in here on a Friday night, prayed for her. She woke up Saturday, no headache. Woke up Sunday, no headache. Y'all been hearing me? Yeah. Say glory. glory! No headache for you. No stomachache. No stomachache. No diarrhea. No diarrhea. The mama had diarrhea up there and vomited and went to the hospital. No vomiting. No vomiting. No constipation. No constipation. Okay. Okay, I think I got it all. That's all right. Cry to grandma. No arthritis. No arthritis. Hear me? So now, here's how I'm going to end it. I got three minutes. I'm going to end it with this. Y'all ready? I'm talking to everybody in here. I'm going to end it with this. I'm going to give you three warfare moves. On your Bible money. Ready? I'm only going to get three and I'm done. Here we go. In the name of Jesus. I break all assignments. Of the enemy. Against your finances. In the name of Jesus. I break all curses of poverty. Lack. Debt. And failure. In the, name of Jesus. in the name of Jesus. I rebuke. I rebuke. Cast, out. Cast out. All spirits. All spirits. Of the canker worm. Of the canker worm. Palmer worm. Palmer worm. Caterpillar. Caterpillar. And something that Kenya is dealing with like crazy. Locusts. Locusts. Yeah. That will eat up my blessings. That will eat up my blessings. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say this out loud. And this stops it. I seek. I seek. First. First. The kingdom of God. The kingdom of God. And his righteousness. And his righteousness. And all things. And all things. Are added. Are added. Unto me. Unto me. If you believe the word of God today, then give him praise. Amen. 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 Y'all hear me? Yeah. Sunday's in the Next Sunday, First Lady Sandra Jones will be preaching next Sunday. Yeah. So, as y'all get ready to go, oh, see Mr. FBI outside for good. What is it? Fruits and vegetables? Food? Okay. See Mr. FBI outside in her car, y'all. You can see her outside. Yes. Who want to give her a light? Okay. Come in, down. Oh, her name, down. Yeah. Her name, down. Come on, down. Come on, down.
grandma. Because they love it in here. And they've been asking mama to come. Mama here today. You want to get to the line? Okay. This is what the glory is all about. This is what the glory is all about. Glory is all about. Yeah. 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 This is what the glory is all about. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, just repeat after me, okay? Let the mind 
That being Jesus Christ. That being Jesus Christ. Also being down. Also being down. That scripture. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Have the same mind as Christ. Thank you, Lord. So no medication. No medication. Will be needed. Will be needed. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Lord. Lord. Set your glory cloud on top of her head. Set your glory cloud. Let the glory fill her skull up. Yes. Let the glory fill her skull up. So there won't be any room for anything negative. Because the glory will fill her house up. The glory will fill her house up. Oh my God, my God. In the name of Jesus. Depression. Depression. Go. Go. Now. Now. In the name of Jesus. And let her go. And let her go. I bind you I bind to you. the blood. I bind you to the cross. I bind you to the glory. And in Jesus' name, in Jesus name we, root you out, we root you out. Never to return. Never to return. In Jesus' name. In Jesus to his glory. To his glory. Ooh, seal that thing. I'm going to release this holy healing fire into her brain. Yes. This is with the star baby. There it is. Done. Now, now this will be yours. This is the hands that, that I've been growing with all day. Oh, this one hands. Been sitting on Acts 19, chapter, verse 11 and verse 12. It says, And God wrought special miracles. You can make a special miracle. By the hands of God. So that from his body was brought unto the sick handkerchiefs or aprons. Yeah. The diseases departed from them, and the evil spirits went out of them. Don't ever wash it. Keep it to G. You can carry it any kind of way you want to carry it. You? People carry it in their pocketbook, tie it around the ankle, tie it around the neck, tie it on the door in the bedroom, put it underneath the mattress, put it inside the pit, whatever. Carry it any kind of way you want to. Now, now, last thing I want to say to her, and we're going to get ready to roll out. I'm going to bless the communion, and y'all get your communion, y'all roll out. I'm going to see y'all. Now, I'm going to say this to her right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every curse is broken off you. Yes. Thank you. Every demon that tried to keep you from coming here, I will be. They don't want you to reach your true destiny. You can't reach it unless you go with God with it. You got a bright future. You see it. Your sons are gonna be awesome. But they will have an awesome mom. You press your way, you hear me? They're gonna give you every reason, every excuse. They're gonna try to block you because this is hostile territory for unclean spirits. They know they get defeated here. So in Jesus' name. You're free. We got you covered, okay? I give you all praise in here. I'm going to bless this and hang it out. And you get your, oh God, I feel good right now. A million dollars right now. In the name of Jesus, I bless the communion. Yeah, I bless the communion. Oh. Kids, uh, if you want to bless this, Ministry, PayPal me, Facebook, it's right there under my bio. Cash Apples, Periscope, Cash App is dollar sign, Heaven's Best 111. Dollar sign, Heaven's Best 111, follow seven holy go. PayPal me, Heaven's Best Church. It's on Twitter, it's on Instagram, it's on IOs, it's everywhere. Love y'all. Okay, cut it off, children. Trendy, hit it.